Kent. And I'm Billy, and we're here with your Twin Cities Hospitals negotiating update for today. Modifications and counterproposals were shared across the table with only a little movement forward. The employers were rather cagey and edgy when representing their proposal on vacation accrual. This proposal would significantly reduce the earned vacation time for many part-time members. This is not acceptable to our membership and it is clearly a take back. A respected independent analyst and trusted expert said, despite a decline in patient hospital days in 2009, Twin Cities area hospitals enjoyed their best profits in years. These 27 hospitals posted a net income of 485.6 million or 6.5% of net patient revenues. Although revenues increased, the number of inpatient days provided by these hospitals dropped by 4% in 2009. In other words, hospitals have figured out how to increase their revenues while providing less inpatient care. While the rest of us have been fighting through the worst economy in generations, Twin Cities hospitals have enjoyed their best profits in years. While we believe that we would receive a counterproposal to our economic package, it never came. Instead, we will be waiting until at least February 21st to hear their response. Your contract bargaining team is working hard to complete contract negotiations. We're working for justice, equality, and a signable contract. We're still here and we're still working hard. And remember, as always, we're, we're stronger, stronger together. together.